Hello and welcome to Saki Tech. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to completely back up and restore your Android smartphone using a custom recovery. I will be using the TWRP recovery, but the same procedure applies to Clockwork Mod recovery. So this video is basically for those of you who like to switch between custom ROMs on your smartphone, but would like to create a full system backup before you plunge into a brand new custom ROM, just in case things go wrong or maybe you just want to have a backup which is a good thing and that's fine too now I will be using an HTC One M8 to demonstrate the backup and restore process but since TWRP looks the same on all Android smartphones this tutorial applies to all Android smartphones so let's uh, dive in now the first thing I want you guys to do is go to the App Store and download the free application called Goo Manager what this application will allow you to do is it's going to allow you to go to the custom recovery at the touch of a button. So let me um, let me demonstrate really quick. As you can see, there's a bunch of options. We don't need any of those options. All we need is the reboot recovery option. You tap that, you press yes, and this will send you to your custom TWRP recovery without having to press a bunch of hardware buttons on the phone as we usually do so this will take you directly to TWRP at the press of a button it's called Goo Manager once you're in the main menu the first thing you want to press is the backup button tap it and as you can see there's a couple selections that were pre-selected for you it is perfectly fine to leave them as it is the most important option on this screen is where it says storage towards the bottom so let's tap that really quick now here you get three options okay so you can either save your backup to your internal storage which is going to be the storage that comes with your phone so HTC one has 32 gigabytes of storage and it even tells you right next to the internal storage how much space you have free so if you have enough free space you can do a backup right there the second option is if your phone allows you to have a micro SD card you can send your backup to an external well internal micro SD card because it is sitting in your phone and then finally what you can do is you can actually attach a USB OTG cable to your phone and then attach a USB flash drive inside that USB OTG cable let me show you what I mean it is easier to understand if I actually show it to you so that's a USB OTG cable and as you can see on the one end on the top the USB flash drive is attached into the USB port. The other end is a micro USB port, which you attach into your phone's micro USB jack. And then you can actually back up your data straight into that external flash drive and just put it aside until the time you need to restore that data. All right, so as you can see, you have three options. You can back up your data to your internal storage, to your micro SD card or an external flash drive anyway for this example I'm gonna use the micro SD card to back up my phone so let's just go back to the beginning here and you tap backup you pick your storage option micro SD card in my in my case you click OK and all you do is you tap well you don't have to tap you just swipe to backup that's it and the process simply starts and then let me just fast forward this all the way to the end because there's nothing else you have to do till the backup is actually complete okay so the full system backup is complete everything on your phone including your operating system your phone call logs your text messages your music your videos your photos has been saved and uh, let's um, go back to the home screen by pressing that home button so that I can show you how to restore your phone uh, from a backup so let's say something crazy happened and you lost all your data but now that you have a backup all you do is you go back into TWRP and you tap on the restore button this time and if you look at the uh, select package to restore you'll see a list of the packages that you have backed up so that package right there is the one we just did if you have more backs up backups you're gonna see them all listed right here okay so the recent one is gonna show up on the top anyway all you do is you tap on the name of the backup that you want to restore and the process starts automatically I'm not gonna do it in this video because I don't have to restore right now everything is fine with my phone but if something happens I simply come back to TWRP 
I tap the restore button, I choose which backup I want to restore, and the TWRP will take care of the rest of the process. Uh, TWRP or clockwork, clockwork mod recovery, doesn't matter. Okay, the procedure is the same. I just happen to use the TWRP recovery. All right, so that brings us to the end of this video. Uh, go ahead and subscribe to my channel for more videos to come. Uh, give me a thumbs up if you liked this video. And also you can go ahead and connect with me socially on Google+, Facebook, and Twitter, for which all the links are in the description below. Thank you again, and I'll see you the next time. And if you have any questions, comments, concerns, just throw them down in the comments section below.